All right, fam, what's up? So another trip to the trending tray. Uh, I just discovered this trending page on YouTube. I'm a caveman. I'm out of the loop for a very long time. Um, this song says 2024 produced uh, Oh, a Volta. Oh, is that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Erlon, The Beat, and Kanye West produced by those three and Kanye West 2024. So I don't even know who the artist is in this. Um, and I'll say this too. I cannot think of one famous Kanye West song. Not one. I don't know. There must be something I would recognize from back in the day, maybe. But um, I've been tripping out on the trending page a little bit, occasionally going to look at it when I pull up the computer. And, you know, honestly, a lot of the stuff is a little bit, um, it's too raunchy for me to do anything with on this channel. And uh, hopefully this isn't, but I'm going to start recording and see if I can get a reaction video out of this. And um, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest to what I think about these trending songs. I just looked at the YouTube channel, and it's called Playboy Cardi. So I'm assuming that's the name of the artist. It's kind of weird that it's not here in the title. So I don't really know what's going on here, but... He had three point something million subscribers, and I think this view, uh, I think this video within two days is like over eight million views. So <clears throat> it's got to be pretty good. Let's hear this. There's always one thing in common with all these trending tab videos that I see. It's all about flossing that drip. I'm 53 and I'm my kids are getting me more hip. I'm an old father with young kids. And now I know what drip means and riz. And I'm getting a little bit caught up. Okay, so let's go. Yeah, yeah, you came back and you fell. Second place can't be in my face so now. All right, first impression. Here we go. We're still flossing the money. Um, the beat to me, it kind of sucks. It kind of sucks. Is that Kanye? Is that is this? I I don't know what that means. Who made this music? Um, and the voice. It sounds like we're sucking on a helium balloon a little bit here, like really high. Uh, right now, there's no contrast to this music. There's no, I mean, old school rap from back in the day, you know, Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre. I mean, they had some beats that kicked, you know, like, this is weird to me. Hopefully, this shit's going to pop in a second. Okay, this is mumble rap because he said, "Sess, sess, 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 sess." Were there words? Yeah. Uh. Oh, you like that? What? You like that? Oh, really? Really? Eight million views in two days? How many times did he say putting him in a noose? Put him on a noose. Put him on a noose. 2024. Music. Uh, uh, put him on a noose. I mean, maybe it's less about the rap and less about the lyrics and more about 
just showing all the money and the bling, right? The private jets, the G wagons. I don't even know if that's a G wagon. I'm probably wrong. Um, the the jewelry and leather, a full body worth of leather. I mean, I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't see anything in this song that I would ever want to hear again. Honestly, so far at this point, I'd want to turn it off. I don't get it. I mean, I'm not supposed to get it. You know, an older white dude with the full Colonel Sanders beard. I don't get it. I'm even like Lucy Sun. I hope that bitch be hating on me because I got out of bed. Had a far bed with my last bitch because she was just playing with my little time. Is this a different singer here or did he just deepen his voice for part of it? I'm traveling the world at the Pope, bringing the praises right to my son. Shout you gotta be canceled, you make me feel some tight way. You know I can't be canceled because you feel some tight way. I'm in the lane, honey, honey, honey. I'm gonna keep killing these hoes, I'm fucking on my man. Don't be offended. I'm asking this question for real. Is this mumble rap? I've heard the phrase mumble rap before. Um, is this like an extreme amount of auto tune? That's another another what four letter word that um, that I don't really understand how it works. Is this just so much auto tune that this guy never could sound like this, but without auto tune? I'm cooking up like my tape, bitch, it's on me. I told him the glove don't fit, I'm feeling like OJ. I told him the glove don't fit, I feel like OJ. Okay, I heard some words finally. Press my pipe, and I leave with OJ. Ooh, two falls in the sack, got me feeling like Kobe. RP. Uh, I'm my boy, that's your app, dog, don't try shit. Welcome to the party, bitch, we all nonsense. Nice. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> Put him on the news. Put him on the news. Put him on the news. Put them on the news. Put them on the news. I mean, you end up with like 45 seconds of repeated words. Is that the chorus? Put them on the news. Put them on the news. Um, <clears throat> I made my first rap song this year. I'll give you a moment of silence so you can laugh. Um, I've got young kid. Uh, my One of my sons is 12. Expressed an interest. Kinda. So I did it. I did it. I broke out of the box. Uh, his old dad decided to write his first rap song. And this isn't after a lifestyle of like, you know, in the 80s, right? Before rap even existed growing up, trying to put rhymes together to beats, you know? I never, it never even, cons it never even crossed my mind that I could make a rap song until I realized that people were offering up beats for like $15. And I could make my own attempt at a rap song. So I did. I sat down, grabbed a piece of paper. I'm a skateboarder. I wrote a skateboard rap. My lyrics, talking about my life. And I put it on my channel. And uh, <clears throat> I think it came out pretty good. I, I started out doing a reaction to Harry Mack. And it got me inspired to do that. And since then, I've done a couple of songs with my son. My son's done a couple of songs. And we're putting them on this channel and we're trying to just get better. I know I'm going to have to, you know, do a hundred songs before they start to even sound decent, probably. Um, I like the process, but when you're just repeating words, it really is like easy. I mean, or if you're mumbling words or just making sounds, what was he saying? Put them on, put them on, put them on what? Put him on the news, guy. Put him on the news. Put him on the news. Put him on the news. I mean, put him on the news. Grab the shoes. Drink the booze. Fall over the fuse. I'm gonna rhyme these words. Gonna sound like turds. But it don't really matter. Cause the people hearing me don't care. What I say. <laughs> it's absurd. And it rhymes with turd. Ah, 
I don't know what to tell you guys. Is this the end? Put him in there. Put him in there. Uh, uh, pulling that huh. Uh, huh. I mean, I haven't heard Kanye. Does Kanye sing or does Kanye sing like this? What is this? I don't really know what this is. No offense to the person doing this because you know what? I can't get anybody to watch my videos at all. Um, you're clearly doing something right. I'm trying to understand it. So I don't mean to disrespect, but as an older person, I don't get it either. Like, is my operating system that out of date? I mean, if I think back to, you know, Dr. Dre and Ice-T and Snoop Dogg, you know, back to, uh, what was it? Uh, um, ain't nothing but a G thing. Like, those songs were fire, you know? And the gangster rap, like Easy e and, and uh, Tupac and... I mean that the the rap I used to know like where did this come from? I'm tripping on it. <laughs> okay, so listen, this is it. The reason I watch these videos is because I'm trying to be more relevant. I'm just going to say it. You guys know it's true. You see an old guy reacting to music like this. It's just because I'm, I'm trying to be more relevant because I'm a has-been, you know. Um, I've worked my whole life. I've just worked hard, long hours, and I want to try to be cool, partly because I got young kids. And I really want them to do it. That's really my goal here. Is like if I can try to do it and I can have it active in my house where my homeschool kids can be like, yo, I want to be like that dad. You know, my uh, my 12-year-old who's done the rap songs with me rides an SE bike. We both learned to do wheelies a couple years ago. We skateboard together. We ride pools. You know, he catches coping. He catches some serious grinds at nine feet. I mean, he's a pretty awesome kid. But he's an awesome kid because... His dad had to step outside the box and try to tackle some things I never knew how to do. And I'm willing to do that for my kids and along with rap. And I don't get this and I don't get auto-tune. I don't, I don't get that. I don't get how it works. So I want to make a song like this. I want to make a song that's hip. Is that the right word? To you guys, the younger people who listen to this type of music. Um... I'd like to be well-rounded in it at all. So far, I just don't understand it. So maybe you can tell me what it is you like about it or if this... I know when I reacted to Young Boy, some people were saying that that he had a, a really thick accent because he's from Louisiana, you know? And um, I don't hear a lot of that language except for like maybe on the show Swamp People and hearing these like some of these ghetto dudes like chasing alligators and shit around the swamps. Uh, they're, they have a really thick accent, so... I, I understood it at that point that, you know, hey, this is just an accent that I don't understand yet. And if I listen more, I'll get it. Um, it doesn't really hit that gong for me, this 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 song. There was nothing super hot about it. You know, no, no loop or what's the word? No hook. That's super catchy. I'm not going to turn this off and be humming this in my head or singing this later. Unless I... Anyway, anyway, guys. Peace out. There it is. Uh, and I don't remember your name. And I probably won't again unless I catch you on the trending tab in one of these later. So, all right, peace.